Hello, welcome to Savage Deals. It's Anthony Savage here and my beautiful wife. Hi guys. Hi, this is Ariana, in case you guys haven't met her yet. And we are part-time resellers and uh, we're really enjoying it. We just finished January. Today is the first day of February. And we ended January strong with uh, about $3,200 in sales. And we started on what, the 8th or 9th? It was the 9th. The 9th? Yeah. The 9th of January. So, I mean, not bad. We already recouped 100% of our setup expenses with our shipping um, scale, our label printer, and all the packing supplies that we purchased to start off. And we have a ton of priority boxes that have been trickling in and envelopes that we ordered, which are nothing up front, but of course you have to pay priority shipping rates when things go out. But uh, we finished January with, like I said, six orders, and we have right now uh, on our photo slash packing table in front of us um, those items plus another four that went out uh, today, and we're waiting for two more items to get paid for to get shipped out. So, so we've shipped like 60 items, I think you said, this and month? Then, yeah, and then after this we'll be at 60, We yeah, 68 now. Once we have all this packed, so that's great for um, less than a month of uh, time invested into this. So we're really happy. We've sourced a lot of our items from a lot of different uh, thrift stores here in Ohio, and we're in Northeast Ohio. We went to a youth pastor conference over the weekend, and we stopped on our way back um, at a couple thrift stores throughout the Marion and Galleon, Ohio areas. But we live up closer to Cleveland. So we spend a lot of time at the thrift stores in and around Lorraine County. And also we go to... Like bin stores? Yeah. Amazon. Amazon bin stores. Return, Overstock type places. Uh, there's a few of those in, in nearby Elyria, Ohio that we frequent when we can. Usually Saturday mornings. We try to. <laughs> yeah, we try to. Those places are a madhouse. But you can find some really great stuff. Uh, like this item right here. We picked this up. This... And the thing, and I see our light ring here is reflecting nicely on the box here. But we picked this up for seven dollars, and that was what two Saturdays ago. Yeah, because yeah, we were at the conference. So this Saturday past. is the day that they get the new shipments in. So if you want kind of the better stuff, you should be there Saturday morning. And yeah. so this was Anthony was one of the first in lines. Line, yeah, in line yeah, to get it. yeah. So that was seven dollars, and it's new open box which is how I sold it, sold for $119.99 plus shipping. So that's, you know, on a $7 investment, that's a pretty good, uh, you know, price return or value return, I guess. And we also um, found a couple really cool pairs of shoes at Goodwill. Goodwill and Elyria. So this is the first time we've ever experienced anything like this. These don't, you know, maybe to you, they don't look like much. They're definitely not my style, but uh, they're Balenciaga red leather uh, shoes and at full retail these are almost $800 when they're new and they don't look I mean much different than this So these have a little bit of scuffing on them a little bit of a little bit wear. wear a little bit of white paint, but the soles are or the tread rather is basically Like new just a little you know dirty, but all that was in the eBay pictures So they knew what they were getting but uh, we sold these for $249 plus shipping and we spent $6 $5.99 at Elyria Goodwill. We also, at the same time, picked up these uh, Nike uh, Air Jordan retro um, shoes, so they're in pretty good condition. I mean, the wear on these are even better than the other shoes. Than the Balenciaga sold. shoes, yeah. yeah. And these I verified through Check Check, and then eBay does their verification as well, but we paid $5.99 for these, and they sold for $199 plus shipping. So those are some really great um, returns right there, just between the knives or the knife set and those two pairs of shoes. Um, we've probably spent at this point about a thousand dollars on sourcing inventory, um, with you know almost thirty five hundred in sales total, and still over a hundred items listed on the store. So we're pretty excited about that. We have still a lot of items we haven't posted yet. Oh yeah, we have behind I mean... us, behind us over here, we have all kinds of merchandise just sitting in bags and boxes that haven't been sorted yet and we were running this operation from 
our, uh, well, my former man cave. Now it's my man cave again. But we've moved it over the weekend when we got back from the conference Four down to the back. basement. We just so, had too much stuff. I mean, it was, yeah, we, we could not move. We started with six or seven bins, and we're really thankful for the different um, YouTubers like Harry Tornado, Josh and Haley, and um, Froggy, and uh, um, Commonwealth Picker, and, and many others that have kind of showed us how they do things. So we're trying to start adopting those uh, practices and philosophies early uh, with keeping track of things in bins. And now we have a total of 17 bins. They're not all full, and we're going to continue sorting our, stuff yeah, our new stuff into that as we get it listed. Um, but right now it's just sitting behind us waiting to get processed in. Um, but we have a lot of other stuff here for sale that are not for sale, but that we did sell. Um, and one thing that was kind of shocking was um, we picked up at the bin sale. How much was this? This Cardi Mobile? Was that $7? $7. $7? $7? Yeah. Okay. So this uh, we picked up for $7. This we picked up for $3.50. It's a generic version of Cardi Mobile called Snap ECG. This sold today for $40 plus shipping, and this sold for $35 new in box. Um, we accepted the best offer. Um, I counter offered, they, they tried to send me an offer for $20, and I countered it at $34.99 and uh, plus shipping, and they accepted that. But it's just crazy that the generic model um, that's also new sold for literally mm -hmm. less than the name brand. So I thought that was you interesting. Mean more. Yeah, the generic sold the generic sold for more, sold yeah, the than the name brand. brand, which was really yeah. interesting. And, and honestly, there are more sold comps for the generic at a higher price overall than the Cardia Mobile, which I just I still can't believe it. But that was one of our, I mean, for return on investment, those are great, especially since they paid for shipping. And this here is a new open box door handle set from Berlin Modish. If I'm saying that wrong, please let me know in the comments. But it's a um, polished brass, polished, polished. I can't even talk tonight. Polished brass color, and this sold for $49.99 plus shipping, and we picked that up at the Ben store on $4 day. So that's a really great return. And man, we have two more pairs of shoes going out that we paid $3 for and $5 for, and these. Um, this was what sixteen ninety nine that it sold for. Uh, yes. Yeah, and then these sold for twenty three. Twenty three, I think twenty three ninety nine or twenty two ninety nine uh, plus shipping, and you know just really, I mean we're really happy with how the shoes have been going. We have how many pairs of shoes do you think? Thirty, forty. Uh, yeah, and something we have shoes like shoes that we clean that are yet yeah. to be listed. Yeah, we have a whole like we put together a shoe rack that we got at the bin store just to put our shoes on that we clean uh, before we sort them into bins. So we have a lot of stuff that's not even listed yet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten pairs right there. More in the bags behind us. So we have a lot of work cut out for us. Uh, but we're going to be shipping all this out. About $800 in sales the last two days overall. Um, the biggest chunk of that being the Air Jordans and the Balenciaga shoes and the Nanfang Brothers Damascus Steel Knife Set. But we're really happy with that. Have uh, a couple other things that are going to be coming um, are getting mailed out here soon once uh, they pay once the you know buyers pay for them but we're going to spend the next probably 30 minutes to an hour packing this stuff up and starting to take some pictures and get more stuff ready to be listed so thanks for watching please do uh leave us a comment let us know how we're doing give us some suggestions and we'd really love to hear your feedback also don't forget to hit that like button for uh, the YouTube YouTube algorithm, that's really going to help us get out there to more people. And please subscribe and, and uh, tell your friends and family about us. We love to, you know, help take you and them on our journeys as we continue going thrifting and finding new ways to turn uh, these really good finds into dollar signs as we grow our business. Thanks. When we'll talk to you soon. Bye guys. Bye.